The red siskin is a highly endangered bird that lives in the granite outcrops on the Rupununi savannas. Decades of trapping for the pet industry drove them to the brink of extinction and their survival into the future was seriously in doubt. In the year 2000, the world held its breath as ornithologists from the Smithsonian Institute and the University of Kansas led an expedition into the southern Rupununi region. They found several thousand red siskins, a discovery that not only changed the course of the species' history forever, but also inspired the local villagers to embark on a conservation mission that has become a model for local communities the world over. This discovery was important to the world. For us, it was just a bird that the locals know, but they didn't know the status globally. We came together, we formed a society. So that's the official bird of the Sotropony Conservation Society. People knew that this was a special place. In order to have a thriving nature, we have to have thriving communities, thriving people. Conservation really works hand in hand with tourism. Tourism is like a, an example that shows you doing conservation can be beneficial. We're working towards having each community have a, a safe zone for the animals. Our mission to protect this landscape, this little piece of the world, is so critical. We are using nature-based tourism to drive community development, to create changes in local and village economies. So if you have the people taking care of it, then we can be able to keep Rupununi as natural as possible, and then people can come and enjoy this beautiful environment, right? And be able to see some of these unique species and have a good time. I guess that's, that's the point of life, right? <laughs> enjoy it as much as possible. <laughs>